Hey folks, it's Dr. D here. Uh, in this demonstration, we're going to be looking at Charles's Law, one of the uh, gas laws. Um, Charles's Law relates the volume of a gas to its temperature. So the way that we're going to do um, uh, this demonstration is we're going to use some liquid nitrogen. So I've got some liquid nitrogen right here in this container. This is called a dewer. It's like a really big fancy thermos. And I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to put on some special gloves to do this because liquid nitrogen is very cold. So it is minus 196 degrees on the Celsius scale or 77 degrees on the Kelvin scale. So that's 77 degrees above the absolute, uh, absolute coldest temperature possible. So um, let me go ahead. I'm going to pour that liquid nitrogen here into this other doer so that you can see what's going on. Now, one of the things that you might um, uh, observe there in that doer is it looks like it's boiling. And in fact, it is boiling because the temperature of that doer is so much warmer, right? It was room temperature compared to the temperature of the liquid nitrogen that I'm pouring in there. Now, nitrogen, by the way, is about 80% of the atmosphere that we breathe. So it's most of the gas um, that is uh, around you right now. All right, so I'm gonna get this poured in there. We're gonna allow it to um, stop boiling a little bit just so that it's easier for us to see. Okay, so now the next thing that we're going to do to demonstrate Charles's Law is we're going to put some balloons into this liquid nitrogen. So I've got a balloon here. Um, and what we're gonna do is we're gonna uh, put this balloon into the liquid nitrogen and see what happens. Uh, we like to call these a portable air container, right? Portable gas container. So let's go ahead. Um, now the temperature of this gas right now is the temperature um, in this room, which is about 24 degrees Celsius at this point. Um, and what we're gonna do is we're going to see what happens. So you'll see already that the volume of that balloon is decreasing dramatically and in fact it looks like it completely um, uh, all the gas completely um, is gone it's what it looks like in fact it's not gone it is just reduced in volume so if I take this out and we look at what happens to it when we warm it back up here I'll hold it so we can watch We're going to see that as that gas warms back up, that in fact it was still in the balloon and it's going to refill the balloon. So it's going to return to its original volume, the volume that um, corresponded to the temperature in this room. Okay, so there we go. So Charles's Law. Now, just to have a little bit of fun, I've got a few balloons. So we're going to see how many balloons we can stuff into this container of liquid nitrogen. So here we go. Now let's warm them up. Let's warm up. 